is Sony A6400, a camera that we believe offers phenomenal value for money and is considered one of the top cameras under $1,000 in 2024. This device is a favorite among bloggers, vloggers, and independent content creators due to its exceptional photo and 4K video quality. Additionally, it comes with a 180-degree screen and an autofocus system that detects eyes, making it ideal for single-handed video recording. Sony is known for continually innovating and processing an autofocus performance. The company first introduces these advancements in its high-end professional cameras before incorporating them into its consumer models. Consequently, the A6400 benefits from the autofocus technology found in Sony's full-frame A9, A7R3, and A7 III models. It boasts 425 phase detection and 425 contrast AF points, along with an autofocus acquisition time of 0.2 seconds, which Sony claims to be the fastest globally. While the APS-C sensor maintains the same 24 megapixel resolution as the original A6000, it offers a more sophisticated autofocus system, 4K video, and an improved Bions X processor. This autofocus system covers approximately 84% of the image area and remains sensitive down to negative 2 EV. It also includes Sony's renowned IAF system for both single and continuous shooting modes. Furthermore, it features real-time IAF and object tracking, made possible by AI-based object recognition that processes color, subject distance, and patterns as spatial information. The A6400 can record 4K video at 30 frames per second in XAVCS format at speeds up to 100 megabytes per second, or Full HD at up to 120 FPS at the same bit rate. It also provides clean HDMI output for external recorders via its HDMI port. Furthermore, the A6400's flip screen, originally designed for selfie enthusiasts, has become increasingly valuable for videographers. Apart from its advanced autofocus and robust 4K video capabilities, the A6400 is relatively conventional. However, it does offer improvements in image quality, color reproduction, noise reduction, and texture rendering. Its magnesium alloy body is resistant to dust and moisture, and so Sony claims a shutter lifespan of 200,000 dots. Despite its compact size, the A6400 has a commendable battery life, delivering 360 shots when using the viewfinder and 410 shots with the rear screen. The top mirrorless camera under $1,000 for 2024, the Olympus OMDE M10 Mark IV. This latest model in Olympus retro style mirrorless line comes packed with a micro four thirds image sensor that's stabilized, a 4K video capture capability, and a variety of in camera filters designed for creative photographers. It's an excellent fit for beginners, but may not meet the needs of more advanced users. The OMD series from Olympus has always been recognized for its retro appeal, and the EM10 Mark IV maintains this tradition. Available in either black or silver, it features distinct camera dials that lend it a more vintage feel than its digital counterparts. You can purchase this camera body only, perfect if you already own a lens or prefer to select your own, or bundled with a 14 to 42 mm pancake zoom. In terms of build quality, it may not measure up to some high-end Olympus cameras. There's no weatherproofing or magnesium chassis, instead it's housed in a sturdy plastic case, which should be kept away from water. However, there are metal details, such as the dials and lens mount that add a touch of luxury. One remarkable feature is the image sensor's 5-axis stabilizer, a rarity in entry-level cameras. Additionally, it includes a pop-up flash, which is often absent in professional models. While fully automatic modes cater to beginners, the controls aren't overly simplified. The top panel features dual wheels and three customizable control buttons on the right, allowing you to assign different functions to the digital teleconverter, recording, or AEL-AFL buttons. Interacting with menus happens through the back screen, a high-quality 3-inch panel with 1.04 million dots. You can increase its brightness for use outdoors, and hinge allows for some tilt to avoid glare. The screen is adjustable for waist-level photography and can also tilt downwards for overhead shots. An eye-level viewfinder featuring a reasonably sharp 2.4 million dot design is included as well. When it comes to focusing, the EM10 Mark IV employs a contrast-based system that distributes focus points across the entire frame. This means you're not restricted to center focus subjects like you would be with entry-level SLRs. It also boasts enhanced subject recognition, with the ability to detect faces and eyes and adjust focus according Accordingly, thumbs up. The Canon EOS Rebel SL3, touted as one of the best DSLR cameras you can buy for under $1,000 in 2024. Also known as the EOS 250D, this compact DSLR represents the latest addition to Canon's lineup. It boasts a 24 megapixel APS-C sensor equipped with an efficient and user-friendly dual pixel autofocus. The Rebel SL3 is designed with beginners in mind, featuring one of the most intuitive guide modes available on any camera. Similar to the larger Rebel T7i, it's capable of delivering stunning pictures and very 
precarious situations. Furthermore, it offers an enjoyable shooting experience, fits comfortably in hand, and provides exceptional battery life when using the optical viewfinder. Designed with convenience in mind, the SL3 has all the physical controls on the right side except for the menu and info buttons located in the top left corner of the back panel. The rear panel also features a four-way control pad for navigating menus and adjusting the active focus area within the viewfinder or rear screen. The LCD is a standout feature, boasting a 3-inch diagonal and a sharp resolution of 1.04 thousand dots. It supports touch input, allowing users to adjust focus and navigate menus with a simple tap. The screen is hinged, allowing it to swivel to the side, face forward ideal for vlogging, and fold inward for protection during storage or transport. In terms of battery life, the SL3 outperforms many cameras in its class. It can capture approximately 1,070 shots using the optical viewfinder or about 320 shots in live view mode, according to SIPA testing standards. This gives it an edge over many mirrorless cameras in the same price range. Performance-wise, the SL3 is quite impressive. It powers up, focuses, and captures an image in roughly half a second, providing ample speed for spontaneous photography. In bright light, it locks focus onto a static subject almost instantly, stamping a photo in less than 0.05 seconds. The image quality is consistent with what we've come to expect from Canon. The SL3 shares its sensor and image processor with the EOS M50, and the included 18-55mm zoom lens is identical to the one bundled with the SL2. The Nikon ZFC as the runner-up best option. This camera is a mirrorless digital model that draws inspiration from Nikon's classic FM2 film camera, considered an icon in the realm of 35mm film photography. The design is strikingly similar to its forebear, imitating its size, color scheme, and overall aesthetic. From a distance, this camera could easily be mistaken for a high-quality vintage model. The design details extend beyond mere aesthetics. The ZFC includes a very angle touchscreen that can be flipped, replicating the experience of relying solely on a viewfinder. Just as photographers did in the film era. The top of the camera features manual dials for ISO, shutter speed, and exposure compensation, mimicking the tactile controls of traditional film cameras. Additionally, a small LCD screen near the power switch displays the current aperture settings of the attached lens. Complementing the camera body is the bundled 16 to 50 mm lens kit, which aligns perfectly with the retro styling. Compact and lightweight, it underscores the system's portability. Even with the lens attached, the camera can conveniently fit into a jacket pocket. One notable improvement over other models like the Z6 and Z7 is the ZFC's adjustable screen. Instead of only offering vertical tilt, the ZFC's screen can rotate and flip to the front, facilitating selfies and video recording. The touchscreen and menu system are consistent with Nikon's other mirrorless models, with the added flexibility of a 180-degree rotation for various shooting angles. Internally, the ZFC shares many technical specifications with the Z50. The camera sports a 20.9 megapixel APS-C sensor, delivering clean files with enhanced dynamic range and impressive low-light performance. Noise control and dynamic range perform well up to ISO 6400, and the color profiles and white balance modes ensure a consistent look across Nikon's camera family. The Nikon ZFC also provides user-friendly access to auto mode, quick settings, and a handy menu guide. This fusion of vintage aesthetics with modern technology offers a unique photographic experience, making the Nikon ZFC a worthy contender in the sub-$1,000 camera market for 2024. best cameras under $1,000 for 2024, the Canon EOS R10. This camera is a game-changer in its class, offering professional-level autofocus, speed in 4K 60p stills. It also delivers 120p slow-motion capture at 1080p. Despite its modest price tag, the EOS R10 outperforms expectations, delivering capabilities usually found in high-end models. The few compromises include the absence of in-body image stabilization and cropping at 4K 60p. However, these minor drawbacks do not diminish the overall value of this remarkable APS-C body, ideal for hybrid shooting. The EOS R10 utilizes an RFS mount, which maintains compatibility with full-frame RF mount cameras. Consequently, it supports all full-frame RF lenses, including the two new RFS lenses launched with the R7 and R10. Designed with vloggers in mind, the EOS R10 features a rotatable screen for selfies and vlogging. It targets enthusiasts, travel photographers, and lifestyle content creators, packing a wealth of features into a small, lightweight body. It's perfect for those transitioning from smartphone or DSLR photography. At the core of the Canon EOS R10 is a reimagined 24.2 megapixel APS-C image sensor from Canon. This sensor has been modified to deliver improved readout speeds, enabling a rapid 15 FPS mechanical shooting and an impressive 23 FPS burst shooting. A standout feature of the R10 is its advanced dual-pixel CMOS AF2, similar to those found in the high-end R3, R5, and R6 bodies. This system offers comprehensive subject tracking for people, animals, and vehicles. This feature was 
previously exclusive to the professional Canon EOS R3. The camera also boasts case study AF and can achieve autofocus down to a remarkable negative 4 EV. Overall, this model delivers top-level performance at an unbeatable price-quality ratio. You wanted the best, you got it.